Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a new video. My name is Roy and today I'll be reacting to the entry of San Marino. Yes, yesterday they decided, you know what, we're going with this winner and that winner is a known face. It is Achille Lauro and the song that he's going with this time around is Stripper. Yes, I'll be listening to it for the first time. I didn't really watch any of the shows in San Marino. It was quite a lot and um, I mean there was a lot of other stuff going on and I had to make a lot of videos as well. Uh, so I didn't focus on San Marino, I was like you know what I'm just not going to watch it at all to have this first basically impression because I haven't listened to the song yet. So that's what we're going to do today. Um, I'm very curious, Aquila Lauro is of course a very known figure. He's been in San Remo a few times, three times if I'm correctly. Um, he's very, very out there, let's say it like that. Uh, so I'm really curious what this song is about and I'm super excited for San Marino to have such an artist. Like, it, it kind of fits in a way, right? Hmm. Anyways, uh, I think we should just listen to it right now. And uh, if you haven't yet, subscribe to the channel. Just do that. And comment what you think of the song. Anyways, let's get to listening. Let's listen to the song. Yes, uh, it seems like it's going to be a live performance, which is uh, quite cool because I didn't even see any of the Una Voce per San Marino shows so I can get a bit of a glimpse of what it was like. Um, it was a lot of songs, like 60 or something, it's mad. Um, but yeah, I think it's quite a good thing that they went for something like this. I hope this will work for them and maybe they will continue doing this in the future because it's something that San Marino could really use, I think. Yeah, um, but let's get into the song. San Marino, uh, Achille Lauro with Stripper. Let's click play. Questo amore è uno strip club, yeah. il mio cuore è un freezer, freezer suona a letto col killer, thriller. Dai che Virgin, Virgin non è un film, non è un collino. Oh, it's gonna be Rocky or something. I love Britney. You know, we can't really um, fault San Marino for like a poor sound quality. But hey, we gotta ignore that, I guess. What a character. Okay. Yo. I'm so happy that he's going, like, he's one of those artists that I really wanted to go to Eurovision one day, because he's so unique, so different, so out there, I love it. I perhaps missed a bit of a chorus, but maybe we'll get a better one second time around. Oh, nice! And the staging potential with this on, on the real Eurovision stage is immense. And I feel like he, as a person, just, just reigns in the votes on his own. Honestly, this might be one of the better songs that he has performed for like Eurovision Potential song. Like, Rolls Royce was, I mean, whatever it was. Um, what was the other one? I don't remember. But like Domenica as well. I think this fits better for something like Eurovision. Yes! Oh, wonderful! That was really cool. Um, I just can't quite believe that we're getting Achille Lauro at, at Eurovision. That's, that's, that's a madness. Um, 
Yeah, it was very rocky. It was very nice. It was very cool. He delivered it very, very well, um, as he always kind of does in his own unique way. Um, he didn't go over the top this time. Like usually, he does some 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 weird stuff. Like I remember that interval act he did in San Remo 2021. I was like, "What are you doing, man?" And it was like so intriguing. He's intriguing. Um, Call me a fan, <laughs> whatever. Um, yeah, I really enjoyed it. I think that this is a good choice for San Marino. I think it fits as well. Um, it, it's it's really cool. And yeah, we've got to get Akilo Lauro at Eurovision. And of course, there's a lot of staging potential just with him on his own. If you have a good staging with it. Like I think the band idea is already quite good, um, especially since it's kind of more a rocky song uh, than maybe his usual stuff. Um, yeah, I really quite dig it. I think it, it, it's a good decision for some reason. I haven't seen the competition, but I'll listen to that afterwards. Um, yeah, let me know what you think. Um, but yeah, let's wrap this video up. And there you have it. Yes, I just reacted to Achille Lauro's song for Eurovision 2022. I can't believe I'm saying it. Wow. Called Stripper. I don't even know why it's called Stripper. I didn't really hear the word at all in a song, but I, I don't speak Italian, so whatever. Um, yeah, what do you think of the song? Let me know in the comments and um, please share your thoughts about the song or the competition. Do you think that Una Voce per San Marino was a good idea? I think it was. Um, I mean, I haven't seen the competition, but I think something like this could really be a good way of giving maybe smaller Italian artists a chance to get a stage, uh, perhaps go to the final, and you know, it, it isn't necessarily a leftovers kind of national selection, but we saw a lot of the artists that weren't selected. Ellis Mraz, for example, go to San Marino as well. And um, I think this is something that San Marino should keep going. I think if it is successful in Eurovision, and I think this could be actually quite decent, um, yeah, they should definitely stick with this. I think it's quite a good idea. And also with the amount of songs, it's a bit much perhaps. Maybe they could do a few less, but it was quite cool. Anyways, um, I'm gonna wrap it up. So make sure to subscribe to the channel, make sure to comment on the video, make sure to like the video, make sure to share it with your dog, your friends, your family, your mom, your dad, your everyone. And I hope to see you in the next video. But yeah, for me, today, goodbye.